Hello and welcome to another Smur P video and today we are looking at the Marvel Legends line which is the Deadpool series so here he is in his box there's the top get an awesome picture on the side move it towards the light a little bit there we go very cool there's the back um yeah ah uh, I don't have a clue what he does in this uniform. Not a clue. And these are the other figures from the line. Very, very cool. And they build this fella right here, Sasquatch. Let's get him out of his cage. Okay, right. I'm gonna get into my gripe because I have a re really, re really major gripe. It's um, it's like Hasbro don't know what uh Deadpool's role in X Force was. Um, it was a mutant team taking out bad guys led by Wolverine, basically. Um, and he was a different kind of Deadpool. He was less, um, he wasn't as jokey. He, he was actually committed to this team, so to speak. So with the serious tone of this series, we get this. Now what, the, what the hell, you know, this looks like some sort of alien pea shooter, man. And I have no idea what the hell's going on. This is a covert operation. You expect dark, dark weapons or grey. You know what I mean? And then this. This looks like something that I give to my my nine-year-old. And, you know, he walks, he, he squirts water out of. <laughs> you know, it, it's it's like a kick in the teeth. Now, I know that there was... Um, uh, this Deadpool was released as a, a special edition last year at Hascon, Con, whatever it is. Um, and he had all the accessories that the Deadpool had um the red deadpool had basically and, and it's almost like we we've um we're like second class citizens getting this figure so we're gonna give them some little pretend weapons and not some serious weapons you know and i just don't understand the reasoning behind it people spend money on this they invest in this you know they want their deadpool to look awesome on the shelf and if he's holding this, I, I'll be honest with you, I can't see it growing on me to actually like it. Um, it looks like, I don't know, I don't know what it looks like, but it's, ah, it's really irritated me. Um, the swords on the other hand, oh, sorry, my hand got in the way. Um, the swords look really nice, I'm really impressed with the swords. You know, we need a couple of decent swords. Um, and you get the head of Sasquatch as the builder figure. Which I will look at when I finish with the other figures. Oh, there we go on the side. Okay, so in terms of the figure itself, I'm really impressed with the, the actual figure himself. It would have been cool to have him. Um, he was always chomping in this series from what I can remember. It would have been cool to have a half mask uh, Deadpool head. You know, that would have been quite cool. But other than that, you know, it looks really cool. The grey looks really, really nice. I'm really impressed with the grey. The nice belt. He's got a holster there. For a, a real gun, not a baton gun. Nice X there on the belt. The belt looks really, really solid. I'm really impressed. Really impressed with the the figure is the impressive part on it. A couple of dodgy marks on the back, and he's got his he's been uh, tattooed there with a number. These are the sheaths for uh, the thing, and he's got a kind of like a bit, a bit of a backpack uh, hold that you could do something with him, perhaps. So, um, yeah, in terms of figure-wise, I am really, really happy. Um, so let's get some comparisons. Let's get his counterpart from um, 2013, the first release of Deadpool X-Force. Okay, so first of all, here he is with the 2013 Deadpool. And this guy, he got the serious weapons. You know, he got a proper gun, he got some swords, and he even got a, a little sidearm down there that's pretty sweet. Um, now, I still dig this figure. And um, other than, I guess, articulation, and I guess this guy looks a bit more bulkier, you know, uh, he's, still, he's still pretty cool. I mean, I like this, but um, looking back at some of the pitch, I don't think he actually um, he actually had this. Um, it, was, it was like this, so you got to give Hasbro that. Um, they, got, they got how he looks pretty, pretty accurate, but, you know, I still dig this, man. I can't help it. Two Deadpools are better than one, I guess. Okay, and there they are together, holding their weapons. Guess which one's more serious? 
So why it's all serious? Sorry, joke a joke. We don't have joker jokes in Marvel world. Right. Um, yeah, so let's um, put him with the rest of the X-Force team. Now here he is next to the rest, the rest of the X-Force team. Minus Deathlock because I've not dragged him out of his cage yet. But I, I, I would definitely um, put them together when that happens. <laughs> Probably in the next few days. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm really liking it. Um, I I really like Deadpool in X-Force. It, it, it did show us a different kind of Deadpool. But I always felt like uh, Deadpool and Phantom X were kind of in the background. And, and the kind of main story revolved around either these two. Or Wolverine sort of thing, um, but um, X Uncanny X Force is a, is a really good series. So if you haven't read it, uh, it, it's a it's pretty pretty dark, pretty interesting, good writing. I think one of the best um, writing in in years, to be honest, in terms of uh, X Comics in in my mind anyway. So there we go. Okay, so back to Deadpool. Um, one thing that um, this this sword fits in really really well looks really cool uh, this one is uh, really really loose <laughs> so he's not gonna you, you can't do certain poses with that which is a bit annoying maybe they should have given us interchangeable hands you know they give us hands for everything else why why not this guy you know just a couple of here's some gun hands here's some sword hands and here's some fists you know you can really make a, a girl uh, stuff. Also, I just wanted to um, try and get a close-up of his eyes to show how red they are. There we go, and they do look really nice. I do I really dig this head sculpt. Okay, so all in all, this is a really, really cool Deadpool. Um, the only letdown was the weapons. I don't know what Hasbro. It's like they're punishing us for not spending a stupid amount of money on their has one. But they didn't release enough of those, you know. Otherwise, there would have been plenty for people to buy from them. It's like they screwed us over. But here, you can have this guy. But we're going to give you crappy weapons. So that's my real, real, ah, uh, in the way in bed of him. And damn, I just checked out that six pack. Look at that. That's awesome. So um, he's definitely a good figure to grab. Um, I think he is an upgrade to, to the F1 um, in terms of size, etc. I think he does... He probably looks a bit better. So um, tell me what you think. Do you like him? Uh, you Did you like his weapons? <laughs> Are you playing Nerf Wars with them? Um, tell me what you think. Other than that, take care. Embrace the geekiness. Good night. Good day. Goodbye.